welcome back to another computer sluggish video. Have you subscribed to my YouTube channel yet? If not, be sure to click on the big red subscribe button and click on the bell to get notified when I upload a new video. Also, don't forget to check out my social media channels. In today's video, I will be showing you how to change the default font in Windows 10. To start off with, first you need to open up Notepad and once you have opened up Notepad, you now need to click on the link that's in the description below and copy the code and paste it into Notepad. Once you have pasted the code into Notepad, we now need to choose which new font we want to use in Windows. The default font is Sego UI. We now need to go down to the bottom left hand corner of our screen and type in Control and you need to open up Control Panel. We now need to change the view by to small icons and we then need to click on fonts. You now need to choose what font you would like to use. For example, I could use Arial, I, I could use Bangers Regular, I could use Book Antique, I can use whatever font I want. I'm just going to use Arial for this tutorial. You now need to go back to Notepad and you then need to copy the font that you would like to use. For example, I want to use Arial, which means I need to spell it exactly the same as it is in the fonts folder. You need to change the new font text to the font you want to use. Arial, A-R-I-A-L. And as you can see, it's identical to the file name in my fonts folder. Once you have done this, you now need to click on File and we need to go Save As. You now need to choose where you'd like to save the registry tweak to. I'm just going to save it to my desktop and you now need to give it a file name. I'm just going to call this font tweak and you then need to go .reg and we need to save the type as all files and go save. We can now close down notepad and we can close down our fonts folder and you will now have a registry tweak. Before you run this tweak, you need to back up your registry. You can back up the registry using the actual Windows registry. I will put a link in the description below on how to do that. Or you can use a program like CCleaner or many other programs to back up your registry. Once you have backed up your registry, you can now go ahead and run the tweak. All you need to do is just double click on the registry tweak and then go yes. And we now need to press OK. And you now need to restart your computer for the tweak to take effect. And once you have restarted your computer, you will notice the fonts are different. And as you can see on my desktop, the font is now different. If I go down to the bottom left hand corner, you can see the search is different. And if I actually open the search and type in, for example, control panel, you can see the font has now changed. And that is how easy it is. If you do want to change the font back using the tweak, then all you need to do is right click on the tweak and then go to edit. And we now need to change the font name on all these lines here to what you changed the font to. For example, I used Arial, which means I need to replace this bit with Arial and the same on all the rest of the lines. And once you have changed all these lines, you then need to do a swap on the bottom line. For example, I need to put Arial on this side and Sego UI on the other side, like that, and then Arial there. And once you have done this, you can now go File and Save, and we can run the registry tweak again. And that is it for this video. Like I said, if you do have any issues and this registry tweak doesn't work, then restore the registry that you backed up. I hope this tutorial has helped. If it has, hit the like button below and subscribe for more computer sluggish tutorials. Don't forget to check out my social channels.